this, oh my, my friends, is the legend. The legend spoken of only in the deepest, darkest recesses of people's worst nightmares. But now, it has come to be a reality. The problem is, is that it requires patience, and I don't have a lot of that. Oh no! <laughs> I've, I've noticed. Hmm. Ah. I mean, that's a deep ass engine room. You think you would hit water or something eventually? I mean, you think you'd hit the bottom of the boat? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that too. Yeah, didn't the writers think about how it doesn't make thematic sense with a boat to have it be bottomless? Riders? <laughs> More like I mean, you, you can logic it through because this is an engine room. I'm sure the oil there is extra, extra gross. And this just like, if you mm. breathe in any of that, you're just done. Oh, <laughs> that was almost bad. <laughs> that would have been hilarious. Do, 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 do. Oh, that's <laughs> that'll get to there fast. <laughs> I mean, technically, you know, it's like... Okay, I'm not even angry about that one, that was really funny. Ooh -wee. It's like as a kid when you're long jumping in Mario 64 and you're just constantly ground pounding all over the place. Mm, yeah. Ooh, boy. I haven't even actually gotten to the race part yet. <laughs> I mean, you, <laughs> you sort of did once. <laughs> yeah, my first attempt was my best attempt. So it's time for... Uh, oh no. Yeah. Well, if I want to die from, like, oil water now, I definitely am. Yep. Getting the immersive experience of what this place smells like. <laughs> Why does Tim's fart smell like oil? Uh... Because I had vinegar oil on the sub I ate yesterday. And he also uh, eats pizza a lot. <laughs> I do get that pizza. There's a cute girl at the pizza place that I keep thinking about. <laughs> oh, wow. That redhead. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nice. Wow, just call her out directly. Here's her name and address. <laughs> I actually don't know her name. I've talked to her a bunch, though, like a lot of times that I've gone there. For That's a while, cool. I was tipping people with $2 bills just because it was fun, and she, like, always liked that, so. It kind of, like, got us talking a few times. Ah, uh, yeah. I guess, yeah, I don't know if you know about $2 bills being Canadian, though, but, like, uh, we have a $2 bill, though, but it's really uncommon where you don't really see them out. And it, there's kind of, like, superstitions, like $2 bills are lucky and stuff. We've had $2 bills, or we had, rather, $2 bills since up to, like, the late 80s, early 90s, then we phased them out and turned them into the toonies instead, so the $2 coin. Yeah, you, you guys have yeah. $2 denominations commonly everywhere, and I like cool. that, because they, they are pretty useful, but... Yeah, down here, the $2 denomination is like, rarely ever you- what the oh, frick was no. that? Oh no, I can't believe you slipped on that. That did surprising. not look like it was too steep. Hmm, yeah. Uh, <sighs> you can tell I'm getting impatient because I just had that thought. I can make uh. a safe state in that room and not have to do the switch every time. <laughs> that just crossed my mind for the first time of, I can make safe states, I don't have to do this. <laughs> well, here's the thing, there's um, also the rewind feature. I guess there is. I didn't know that was a thing for the N64. Uh, at least I think the N64 still has that feature. It'd be weird if they took that feature out of this one, but let all the other ones have it. I used to be able to sing your cover of Reptilia, like, the entire way Dude, through. Dude, I don't even know what the fuck I said <laughs> in that cover of Reptilia. I don't know, get it, how many people still remember it that well. <laughs> like, that was pure train of thought. Like, Do you, do you like, want me to see how far I can get in it? No, I mean, if, if you, if it'll help you, sure. I don't because know. If, if I know my luck, if it's anything that I like related to my content that I just like have forgotten about, it will somehow give you strength. Okay. So do it, because that means you'll win it this time. Come on, come on now. Let's keep moving now. Why is this so slow? Don't make me fast forward because I it guess really I was wrong. <laughs> Damn. Can I jump over here? No, I probably can't. Goodbye, Yoshi. I hate you. I gotta run. Didn't make it in time. Rewind some space time. Na 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 na. Lost my lyrical list, and I don't know what I'm doing anymore now. Wish these lyrics would be on the screen so I'd know them. I hate making up stuff because my voice goes out of tune. 
This level is really taking a time to go through. Nothing's really standing out. I can't sing the blah. Please don't slow me down, cause I'm going too fast. I can't make easy jumps anymore, apparently. I hate when that happens. Do 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 do. Why can't this level go any faster? It would be nice. I hate playing around so long. That's my only complaint about scrolling levels. And the clock is under a hundred seconds now. That means <laughs> oh we God. could be in trouble if this level's programmed wrong. Oh wait, there's the exit. <laughs> that wasn't hard at all. But I don't mind cause it was kind of fun to play. Do -do 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 -do. Guitar solo! I can't believe I still knew the whole thing. <laughs> that was scary in a way, but impressive at the same time. I, I used to, I, I was just like, I used to know the whole thing. I don't know if I still do because I haven't sung it in like 10 years, but. He's like physically bouncing up and down. Oh, for oh, no. <laughs> and the second he stopped, the second he stopped. Well, I died in the middle Man. of it too, so apparently That's, it made me weaker. <laughs> apparently your well, song made you me what. weaker. <laughs> Oh my god! I had Who's to laugh. That? Hearing that song, I could hear the original version of the song in it, like, even though you weren't quite singing it right, I'm just like, yep, that's at this part of the song. That's at this yeah. part of the song. It's a good song. Oh yeah, Reptilia. The Strokes do some great stuff. Yeah, I think that was actually the first time I'd even heard that song when it was in that video of yours, so, like, that made me, like, get that album. What a strange way to discover music, Mario and, Romack and videos. And some, some people told me <laughs> that's how they discovered some bands was from my stuff, which was... I wish you could still do that, but like, that's just not copyright allowed. No. It you, technically you, yeah. wasn't back then, either. You got me into Rival Schools. Uh, there's that one Mario Romhack video where you're, where you're going down a slide really fast and fast forwarding at points, and it's playing the Gourmet Race from Brawl, and it's just like an awesome <laughs> combination that just works really well. Yeah, that's another good one. That's when the brawl brawl had just come out, so the soundtrack was everywhere. Oh yeah, the soundtrack for Brawl. I remember when that came out. It was just unreal how much people were into the music. I remember the first time that uh, I ever like heard the Final Destination theme for that game. My friends and I were just freaking out over how good it was. The amount of hype that Brawl mm. had leading up to its release, I don't think will like ever be topped by another game. <laughs> Well, because they were doing this, that's where they started doing the slow reveal of characters, because they had a site dedicated to it, so everyone was checking it, like, at, at every day, hoping for a new one. Mm -hmm. and it was the first time they did the remixes, like, officially with guest uh, musicians and composers. Like, it had a lot going for it. Mm -hmm. It's very fast. Made me kind of glad that I was oh, I guess I want to go this way. It made me kind of glad that I wasn't, like, a competitive Melee player who was just dying for the sequel to the game, though, because I... Back at that time, there was, like, no sign at all that, like, people were just not going to be into Brawl competitively as much. Oh. Ooh. Because <laughs> I remember, um, the, the Melee tier list that came out in, oh, late 07, I think it was, was intended to be the final Melee tier list because the community had the opinion that nobody would play Melee anymore once Brawl was out because it would just be better. Yeah. So... Yeah, like, I remember there was that, um... I remember that it was playable at e for all that year, and some of the competitive community went, and some of them noted that the game was different, though, but there wasn't really, like, any, like, widespread negativity. Even, like, players like Gimpy Fish, who were, like, really negative about it down the road, I remember that even they at the time said that it was, you know, very good. It was just different. And I remember that, um... They weren't aware that tripping was a random thing. They thought it was a dodge mechanic, and they just weren't sure how to trigger it. And they were trying to figure that out over the course of their few days with the game, though, but no one could figure it out. And then when the game finally launched, they realized, oh, this was to make this game non-competitive. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a bummer thing. That's, that's like, the biggest, one of the biggest things I have to complain about Brawl is that. Well, like, okay. Basically what happened was, like... So the... the I, I could be wrong, because I'm not a Melee competitive player or anything like that, but the way that I've always kind of looked at it was that... Them making Brawl, you know, have all these things about it that made it, like, non-competitive and have a lot of character balance seem like it was done with items in mind and stuff like that. To me, it felt like Nintendo was basically going, you're having fun wrong, let me show you how to have fun. Yeah, kinda. Where they made it so that we're gonna make a game that has better graphics, more characters, more stages, more music, more everything, and it's gonna be bigger and better, though, but we're not going to allow you to, like, 
play it the way that you want because you're having fun wrong. Oh. Oh. Speaking of having what, fun wrong. One of my mm -hmm. podcast buddies has probably the best summary for what Nintendo likes to do at times. Mm -hmm. He calls it Nintendo likes to have take the fun hostage. Mm. That's an interesting way to put it. Yeah, Nintendo holding the fun hostage. Well, every time they announce a new Paper Mario, I'm just like, please let this be the one that's like the first two again. I've been waiting like 20 years. <laughs> And I'm like, I wouldn't mind so much if you experimented if you know you didn't take 20 years to make another one like the old ones. <laughs> and it's like, as long as they keep going in that direction, we keep going another five years without one. So that's kind of how that feels. It feels like it's being held hostage. There's also, um, I guess like... It's been described as, like, holding a franchise hostage, though, because what happens so often nowadays is that you'll have a franchise that won't have a game for, like, ten years, and then they'll finally bring it back, but not as the thing that it was, where, you know, they'll bring back Chibi-Robo, but as a 2D platformer, and they'll be like, well, if this Chibi-Robo game that isn't actually Chibi-Robo doesn't sell well, we're just not gonna make another Chibi-Robo game. Yeah. Yeah. I remember so Monkey dumb. Ball- I remember Monkey Ball did that, too, where they did Banana Blitz HD. And they officially said that if Banana Blitz HD doesn't sell well, they won't make another one. Super Monkey. But didn't they ball. after, or is that or am, I, they did. am I confusing it with a different one? Yeah. They did. They remastered the first two, but everybody wanted them to remaster the first two because they were just like, dude, Banana Blitz is not, you know, what Monkey Ball was, you know? Yeah, because Banana Blitz was the remake of the Wii one, right? Yeah, it was. Because a lot of people like the series because it was like really brutal and it was like, you know, just like very replayable though, but <laughs> freaking oh my <laughs> god! You gotta, you gotta uh. wait. I'm not good at mm. that. <laughs> I have yet to actually make it out of the boat once. Oh god, uh -oh. I'm dead eight lives! Oh boy. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> Breaking news, Banjo and Kazooie starting to run out of trophies of themselves. Emil still not sure what to do to actually finish this Jiggy. <laughs> Did you know that Jiggy has never played Banjo Kazooie and his name doesn't come from that at all? I found that I know, out. Well, it's year. also spelled differently too, to be fair. Well, yeah, but I thought he did that because he wanted it to be unique to him, though. But yeah, it was I, I found that out this year that he'd never played Banjo Kazooie. Yeah, we're hitting we're hitting two and a half hours on mm. basically just this stage. Mm -hmm. Yeah, what well, what's the in-game clock say? Bring up your totals, I'm curious. No, come on. View totals. It is two, two hours, hours and nine two minutes. Oh nine. I think All that right. is the longest. I don't think we've broken two hours on a level before. I think one, Mad Monster Mansion got close. 140 or 120 was Mad Monster Mansion, so yeah. Let's wait for it to stop moving so we can jump. Jump, jump, jump and jive and oh, oh, oh. Readjust my oh, that song, again. Jump Jivin'. Uh, <laughs> so when I was a kid, I thought the song was Drunk Drivin'. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> Which looks really dark. <laughs> I was singing along yeah. to it. My parents realized, like, wait, he's saying Drunk Drivin'. I was like, oh, that's what I thought it was. Oh no! Oh! Uh, can we nope, just that wasn't like I don't know, me. go to like the local authorities and make bottomless pits illegal or something? It would only like change this one area. <laughs> I don't. I don't yeah. think the local authorities have time travel machines. Last I checked, anyways. Uh, well, once we make time machines, then we'll go back. Yeah. And that that reminds me of uh, of something I said when I was a kid. I think I was playing Roller Coaster Tycoon, and there was these levels where you can't uh, you can't destroy the trees, and they put them like everywhere to mess with you so that you can't do like complex rides and stuff. They're really annoying levels. They're probably my least favorite level type in the game where you can't mess with the trees at all. And sometimes you can't even build higher than the height of the trees. Is another one, and it always says like you know. Uh, tree removal forbidden by local authority, and I think there's one level where you can't do that, and also local authority prevents advertising. And I remember that I was asking my mom for help while I was playing the game one time when I was like seven, and I was like, how do I pay the government to change the laws? And I'm like, that's when Emil became a lobbyist. Yeah, pretty much. Like, I'm looking back at it now, I'm like, you know, I... I'm not the only one to have that idea, seven-year-old me. <laughs> Roller Coaster Tycoon changed government for the worse. 
I don't know why I'm grabbing these notes every time. I really don't. Yeah. Habit. Yeah. Habit making it feel like you're still playing the game normal instead of doing the exact same thing over and over. Yeah, like, I, if I don't need the notes for anything, if I can get 100% while missing 20 notes, then I might as well just sack these 12 notes. You could also get the notes and then, as a result of getting the last jiggy, make a save state, and then after recording session, you just go back and get them all. Because you already have gotten I, all the other jiggy, or all the other notes, rather. I guess I could. I, I need to not take this so fast. You can be kind of slow on these. The timer is not the problem, it's the platforming that's the problem. Yeah, like that. There you go. There you go. Mm-hmm. One down. Now you're playing Dark Souls. What? Oh. Yeah, now you're playing Dark Souls. You know, that's one of the reasons I haven't bought Elden Ring is I genuinely think that I would not be able to play it because you have to wait too much. <laughs> I'm gonna be real. Uh, so I don't usually like the Souls games, but on a whim, I picked this one up because like I got wrapped up in, I guess, the, the phenomena of it. Mm -hmm. I both love it and hate it. It's I, I mean like this weird like tornado of like I have these complaints that apparently are in all of the games But like the things that are also in the game are some of my favorite things. So it's mm. like this weird Mix-up. I think this mm. is like my favorite game for exploration since like breath of the wild and I don't mm. like open-world games that much huh. But like I have really really enjoyed exploring in Elden Ring. It's probably one of the strongest things in that game but man, just the combat, I just do not mesh with at mm -hmm. times. Sometimes yeah, I watch... it's fantastic, sometimes it's just the most frustrating experience. I watched one of my friends play the original Demon Souls when it first came out, and I think I watched him play it, and he got to, like, the first boss of it, and he was stuck on it for a whole day, and I was like, I'm never playing that. <laughs> Yeah, no, mm. I, I have patience issues that sometimes stem from my ADHD, sometimes just stem from just the way I like playing games. Because, like, I I love character action games like Ninja Gaiden, Devil May Cry, and Bayonetta, uh, where you have, like, super quick moves, you can get out of most <laughs> situations, you can block wow. most things. Oh. Nice save! Jeez! <laughs> But like, like all like the, these fast, tight controls, and then like the, the the Souls games are very, very deliberate in what you do in the games. Like if you swing, you can't do anything else till that swing is done. There's no cancellations or anything like that, so you have to be careful how you play. I've had a lot of people tell me it's more like playing a puzzle game that ha that that is combat. It's a puzzle combat game, which I can believe. Hmm. Mm. It's kind of funny that you're saying that now, though, because um, that's one of the that's that's what the um, Dynamo Rollers whole gimmick is in Splatoon. And I just recorded my audio for that the other day, where I went over how once you have done a swing, you cannot do anything else, and it's very like deliberate, where you are locked into any action you do with that weapon for the long haul. Oh, Freaking ooh! At least you got the one up. Okay, I, I'm going to give this, I think, one more attempt, and if I can't do it, we're saving this for next week, though, because I'm getting so hungry that I think it's messing with my ability to focus. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I'm we'll just come back like, next week and yeah. you'll get it on the first try. Yeah, I'm just getting to the point where I'm just like, I just want to eat! Can you just stop being such a... We've been here for hours! I was gonna say, <laughs> I wonder how that feels, Emil. I wonder how that feels. Rusty Bucket Bay, more like Krusty Fuck It! Wow. Kay. Krusty, I never even thought <laughs> to use that. Thank you for going with that for the last word. Yeah, you know, I, I, I thought that one through before and I was like, you know, oh. I, I need to be careful even worse and make that, it clear that that is a letter K and not, you know, something that sounds similar to it. <laughs> hmm. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> so I chewed off his leg and he <laughs> ate off my eyebrow and I <laughs> forgot the words to the song and... <sighs> so I bit his ear and he chewed off my eyebrows and I... Oh shoot. <laughs> right, I forgot <laughs> Took too. out his appendix. And... This is esophagus. Yeah, and it's oh, like, yeah. yeah, something about esophagus and like a colonic... Irrigation. Colonic irrigation, you just, yes, it. you better believe it. And somehow, in the middle of it all, the fun got knocked off the Would you stop being <laughs> painful? This is your last attempt, so take your time. Make it count, baby, make it count. Huh. Mm -mm. That was a little, a little earlier, but it's fine. Uh, 
That's one. I still say, they had a lot of faith in eight-year-olds back then. <laughs> I mean, again, you don't need all 100 Jiggies, so... This, like, I definitely remember as a kid when I got to play the game in full after playing it at my cousin's place, I was like, yeah, I'm probably gonna try skipping this one, and then I eventually got it, because it was bugging me not getting 100%, but this was definitely one of the ones I was like, mm. all right, I'm gonna skip this one. Gotcha. All right, that's cool. This camera not being quite cooperative. Yeah, it's a little bit. Uh, it's a little jiggy. <laughs> All right, easy way. All right. 65 seconds. Fifty seconds. Oh, oh, what, what is that? Oh, wow. No. Okay. Yeah. Just keep going. You're okay. At least, yeah. It didn't knock you off. That's the important thing. If you had fallen down, it was basically over. Twenty-five seconds. Fifteen seconds. He's got Boo, it. Boom, bitches! I think there's supposed to be a yawn there somewhere. Get out, out of there! There you go. Oh my god, jeez, I thought you weren't going to get out of there. Oh my god. Oh, you did Man, it! I have conquered the bay! That was more generous oh, wow. than I remember being. Yeah. <laughs> Well mine. done. Well done indeed. It's all mine. Maybe I'll come through and do the notes later in my spare yeah. time. The notes aren't as bad because you don't have to do the, yeah, the I, I, stuff. The fact them. that I don't need them for everything. Just I, get those I, notes I, first and then get the rest. Yeah, I might. I don't know. Okay. If you do it, yeah, obviously. Okay. Saving now and forever holding my peace. Thank you so <laughs> much for joining us. <laughs> oh, good lord. Dan, have fun editing this one. Yeah. Uh, all right. We appreciate you so much, Dan. Thank you. Yes, we do. All right. Bye. Bye. Oh, God, there's one level left. <laughs>